everyone, I'm Ella and today I'm doing a really exciting video for all of you internet people and that is a haul from literally one of my favorite cities on in the world, on the world, in the world, in the world. I'm doing a haul from one of my favorite cities in the world and that is London, England. I recently went there for break and it was great, okay? It was probably one of the most fun trips I've ever been on and I did some shopping while I was there but not a lot because things in England compared to America are so freaking expensive. So I got some clothing and some makeup and I think I'm going to start off with makeup because that is what is closest to me and I'm a lazy person. So clearly, first of all, my hair color is different and that is because I bought hair dye while I was in England. And I know that's kind of a weird thing to buy and like spend your money on while you're on vacation. But this is a like product that I used to use all the time in middle school and they stopped selling it in the United States like they just discontinued it and they have it in England still which is really cool so I just wanted to get it again because I like it. So this is the Clairol Nice and Easy hair dye but this is not just any Clairol Nice and Easy hair dye. This is the 8 shampoo like last up to 8 shampoos non-permanent one and I like this because I'm the kind of person that like will change their hair again and again and again and again um, and always just get sick of it and if this only lasts eight shampoos and doesn't damage your hair it's great and this one is in 765 medium brown this is not the color that I have on my hair now the color I have on my hair right now is the dark brown one which is the darkest one it looks black on the box and it kind of looks black on camera right now but in real life it low-key looks green which is not cute but it only lasts up to sh eight shampoos so it like doesn't matter because it will literally like be out of my hair by the end of two weeks I got a ton of amazing British like makeup products that we don't really have here like we have similar things but not these brands the first thing I got was the revolution um, makeup revolution London vivid baked highlighter this is what it looks like this is one of those like mineral baked or baked mineral powders and this is like a highlighter so it's like pinky and like really 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 shiny and like iridescent and it is great this was one pound which is a great deal because half of the things in England are so expensive. Do you see like right here where it's really, really shiny? That is the highlighter. This is amazing for a drugstore product. I have literally discovered my new favorite highlighter and it's this and it was so cheap. So great discovery. Thank you to Superdrug, my new favorite store. Also from Makeup Revolution London, I got a blush palette and this is the Golden Sugar palette and this is just literally full of beautiful baked mineral blushes and bronzers come on buddy there we go these are the colors that come in it there's a like whitish colored highlighter that has flecks of gold in it there are like two main bronzers and then six blushes and they are all beautiful i got two products from the brand miss sporty um the first one i got was this just clear mascara and if you watch beauty videos a lot like I do, um, you would know that a lot of people use clear mascara to like set their eyebrows and keep them from like moving and like the color transferring. And then I got the plump up or pump up booster mascara. And this is like the kind that like has, I don't even know if you can see that. No, now you can't even see it even more. Um, it has like the three like balls. Yeah, three balls. Cool. Now, if you watch a lot of British makeup beauty gurus um you have probably heard of these sleek makeup palettes and this is probably the one that i hear the most about and this is the storm palette and i saw this and i was like oh my gosh i completely forgot about this i haven't heard about this in a while i need to get it these are the colors they are literally beautiful i like them because they're very like subtle like not natural colors like there's greens and red colors in here but they're also colors that like aren't like in your face and there are a lot of like shimmery colors and also like matte colors so it's a good combo and it's kind of similar to the Naked palette but better because it was cheap and the last makeup product that I got was also from Sleek and this is the Eyebrow Stylist in Dark because my hair is dark now at least for 8 shampoos my hair is dark so basically one end of this has a spoolie and the other end has like a crayon to fill in your eyebrows with and ever since I started using this people have been complimenting my eyebrow game left and right and it's great because I have no eyebrows so if I get complimented on my eyebrow game 
you know it's a good eyebrow dye so I like this 10 out of 10 would recommend all right moving on to clothes the first thing I got was this baby pink coat and I low-key regret buying this in England I don't regret buying it I just regret buying it there because this is from American Apparel and we have that all over America hence the name American Apparel but I got this on Black Friday and apparently England does that now they do Black Friday they don't do Thanksgiving obviously but they do Black Friday this is on sale from 240 US dollars to 70 US dollars and that is so freaking good then I went to Topshop because we don't have that where I live the closest one is like multiple 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 hours away my camera keeps stopping the recording but I was saying I got this baby pink slash mauve colored dress this is a very basic dress it has this tie up here but I am not planning on using it it's three quarter length sleeves. It's a very nice like silky chiffon material. I don't think it is silk or chiffon, but it's really soft. Has a v-neck. It goes down to about mid thigh and has a beautiful slit in the side. Would recommend. I had to be the most basic tourist ever. I don't know why I'm talking like that. I'm really annoyed. Anyways, I had to be a basic tourist and get this shirt. It says London, England. I'm so lame, but I really just wanted a basic like shirt that I could wear when I'm lazy and just wanted to be casual. That is it for my London haul. Sorry, I didn't have like a ton of stuff to show you guys, but I just wanted to share with you what I got while I was there because shopping there is really fun, even though it's super expensive and you can't get a lot. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up, even if you didn't like it you know subscribe because I make different kinds of videos too so I'm a cool I'm a cool gal like I'm I'm cool quirky and relatable so press that subscribe button and I will see you next time bye